Decatur police have arrested 10 people for looting last night. WCIA3's Karina Rubio is live at Tobacco Shack on Grand Avenue. Karina, what have you just learned from officers? Well, Christy, as you mentioned, 10 people arrested. I'm here at the Tobacco Shack right now. Officers haven't been able to tell me if um, the people from Tobacco Shack looting have been arrested, but they have for the ones that have looted Thornton's. And right here at Tobacco Shack, you can see uh, shattered glass everywhere. And a neighbor told me that um, 8 to 10 people actually broke in through this door with some bricks. And also at Thornton's gas station on East Pershing, it is taped off and has shattered doors and windows as well. The regional manager there told me they saw five cars with at least 10 people on the property when the looting happened at about 8.30. The gas station did take precautions to close early last night, so no employees were here at that time. It's still closed now, and the Casey's on West Mound was damaged. It's open, but you can see shattered windows and their doors boarded up. Decatur police say they've arrested 12 people for burglary and criminal damage over the past two days, and as I mentioned, Six of those 12 are being charged with the looting at Thornton's. Decatur police say that they've had a total of 16 incidents reported at businesses over these past two days. Live in Decatur, Karina Rubio, WCIA 3, your local news leader.